Okay guys, welcome back to the channel. As you can see, we have a very special guest. We have Gajesh with us. Now, Gajesh is amazing. He's 13 years old. He's building all kinds of DeFi. He has his NFT project. He has his coin. I mean, this guy is true crypto native, completely, completely dominating the space for his age. And now he's even hiring. He's hiring developers. <laughs> and, that, and that's why we're here. Uh, so man, when I was 13 years old, I can tell you, I, I did not hire anyone. So big, big uh, shout out to you for being so early and building stuff. So please tell us what you are building and what kind of people you need sure so gush finance is building an nft staking platform where people can stake nfts earn gxp points and then redeem this gxp points for more nfts and to make it successful we need like more developers like who have uh, like a friend and experience with like css html and yes javascript and you can just like, join in so so you, you have this project called Gage Finance. You guys are doing NFTs and you have this staking model where you can stake things and you can get points and, and you can acquire more NFTs. Uh, and so you need a front end developer. What kind of technologies do you use? Is it, do, you, do you use guys Morales right now or do you use something else? What kind of tech stack? Sure. So our tech stack is like we use Next.js. Then uh, Next.js, React.js and like in our new version, we are using Morales. Perfect. Plus, and, and, yes, Tenvin CSS. So it is uh, Next.js, React.js, Morales, and then the last one you said, what, what is that? Uh, Tenvin CSS. Got it. So this is the tech stack. And what kind of team do you have right now? Are you alone right now? Or do you already have people working together with you on this? Yeah, right now I have one developer who is like working on like only the css stuff and then like he just sends me the stuff and i like i just work on the web3 stuff and that's like kind of optimizing got it so you, you definitely need uh, more people in the project uh, as it grows and so guys yeah. go to gajesh gajesh uh, nike and you can follow him you can tweet to him or you can dm him and he will get back uh, and yeah, p please tell us also how you found the crypto development because you are 13 and I mean, this is the power of crypto because when I was 13, I also developed, but you know, at that time I could do jQuery, you know, you, you, could, you couldn't program money, you could, you could do some JavaScript and uh, yeah, and, and then that's it. There, it's impossible to do anything financial at that point. But now with crypto, anyone can build anything. I mean, you can be 10, 12, 13, you can build money, mm -hmm. Texas, DeFi, staking, you can sell digital land, digital mm -hmm. coins, the opportunities are endless. It's insane, actually. It's insane. I wish I was 13 again. So please tell us how, how you got into this space and what message you have to the other kids there that also want to start doing something like that. Sure. So, uh, like, so uh, right now my coding journey started back in, uh, back, uh, like, six years back when, like, I just, like, got into this boot camp and I learned Scratch. I was just making nice. some mobile games, and, uh, sorry, like, games. And then, like, I just went to the code side. Like, Scratch was completely no code, like, just drag and drop. Then I went to the no code side, like, going from C to C++, then Java, to HTML, CSS, JavaScript. And, yeah. and like, finally, like, last year, I got, like, got to know about Solidity. And it was amazing, like, where I can, like, program money. That was the yes. best part. It's insane. it's insane. And, like, if you see Web2, like, you need to be more than 18 to build anything. Like you and okay, even though you are 18, like the next problem is regulations. Like there are these like whole damn legal problems that like come up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and like in Web3, it is like okay, you just like open VS Code, write the stuff, deploy it, <laughs> do the front end, and done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, the Web Web three is a is a true eye opener for many people. And also, I saw I saw now that you you're gonna travel this year, right? I saw somewhere that you got your passport, right? Yeah, so you, yeah. You're gonna yeah. you're gonna and you you said that you're dedicating 2022 to traveling, meeting Web three friends, ERL in real life, and building. Yeah. So w what kind of plans do you have for for this next year of traveling? Yes, like I mostly like travel around uh, US and. And like other crypto events which will be happening like in Lisbon and uh, Paris. And like that's like the plan. Nice. 
Yeah, <clears throat> the the events are coming back after the virus situation, so yeah. it's, uh, it's very important actually to, to meet people. And um, you like uh, Ethereum, of course, because uh, but it's a high fee. But also, I, I know that you are a lot in Avalanche now, correct? You, I think you even have the triangle. Do you have? The, yeah, you even have. Yeah, the yeah, triangle. I have the triangle. Yeah, I have the triangle. <laughs> yeah, have the triangle <laughs> then, like the circle of Solana. Like I am a multi-chain maxi. I keep believe in most of the chains because, like, everything will be multi-chain. As like, uh, even the founder of Avalanche said, everything will be multi-chain. Like yes. there will be chains for like every chain will have like a different case or uh, use case, and it will be. Yes, it is like yeah, I like Ethereum for sure. Yes, that's uh, that was that was like first thing I or uh, like second thing which I checked out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean so Solana, it's uh, it's uh, d d absolutely something that most people should learn as well in this age. And the Avalanche, you don't even have to learn anything new. It's just uh, it's just Ethereum as well. And Morales has mm -hmm. Avalanche now. Solana, we're adding in a few weeks as well. So we're gonna have full support. And uh, yeah, any final words to to our community, Gajesh? Uh, uh, Great speaking to you. What what do you want to say uh, as a final thing? Of course, go go and follow Gajesh guys here on uh, uh, on Twitter. Uh, by the way, before we get into the final words, I see that you're part of like Kids Capital DAO. Is that your? Yeah. That's your DAO. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> yeah, 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 that was like that is like something I'm just like trying to like create. It is like a DAO for kids where like kids can invest. Ah, nice, nice. Yes, and like I, I mean, was like, the, like it is kind of I'm just like tinkering around like should I like make it for only kids or like keep it for both kids and adults that like, even like some adults are like kind of like want to be uh, like the kids and boys so. and by the way i see you're also in super team dao what is that i haven't seen it before sure super team dao is like created by these three guys akshay tanmay and cash oh, sorry uh, it is created by six guys akshay tanmay cash neil Shroff, and and devyan so these are like six cool guys and in, in, uh six cool guys building super team and it yep. is like uh it's a DAO for uh, like where investors investors developers and uh like people with talent can just join in and like build stuff so uh, ah, they put out nice. uh like projects put bounties on uh over there then like the member uh, the team uh, like the super team members just like solve those bounties and then, like uh, they get rewarded for that like it's it's uh, like great uh, it's nice super. nice but you know i i'm i'm looking at the kids now and it's i think i'm i'm <laughs> bullish you know why because Kids are gonna be whales, you know. Mm -hmm. Web three kids yeah. that that are in crypto, they are gonna have like a bag of five hundred thousand yes. dollars easily because you play the games and this play to earn is crazy. Look at Axie, man. You have the SLP from last year. You're probably a millionaire today mm -hmm. if you played Axie last year. And kids, they put so much time and effort into playing games. I remember I played RuneScape like all day long when I was a kid. So imagine if if that was play to earn. And and mm -hmm. in in crypto anything is possible. Like as, like we said, we can be ten years old. You can be playing some game. You you slay a dragon. You get some crazy NFT drop. It's worth hundred k on uh, on Open Sea. So they need a DAO. So so that's why. Yeah. <laughs> that, they, they, that, that's why I, I think this is your your kids cap kids capital DAO can can, can be massive. Uh, yeah. yeah. Have you done any play to earn uh, games? Have you played? Do you play something? Yeah, I had, yeah, I had played actually Axie Infinity, and I think I have around fifty SLP, which are unsafe. Nice. Yes. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's it, everyone should try it because you never know yes. what it is. You, I mean. People don't understand how big it is before they try it. And yeah. kids are the first to try. So I'm very bullish. I think the capital is going to move so heavily because all the, uh, all these, I mean, boomers, so to speak. But, you know, we have a lot of people that are all, all that, a bit older. How do you say? A bit older that also know a lot about crypto. So I'm not saying that. But, you know, a lot of yeah. the old generation, they have a hard time wrapping their hand, head around digital. It's 100%. And it's just a generational change that uh, the next generation understands it easily, easily. So that's uh, uh, that's uh, going to be very uh, important in terms of capital change because now everything is uh, digital. So the capital gets redistributed from physical into digital. And that's been going on for already 30 years. 
when you look at Google, Microsoft, Facebook, it's all digital and they're the biggest on the stock market. While everything physical in proportion to digital is losing value very, very rapidly. So that's that's going to be interesting to follow. Now, as a final thing, so Gajesh, what is the last uh, thing you want to say to our uh, our uh, people that watch? It is developers that use Morales, of course. What is your last message to them? Sure. So, yeah, Morales is a great project, and yeah, like I'm super pumped for the Solana integration, uh, nice. Morales Solana integration, and and yes, like so, uh, Morales is a great platform to like save time by building the front end like i have spent i have like saved uh, like a couple of hours like using uh morales and like you like if you are not using morales in your front end you must use it <laughs> that's great yes. thanks thanks for that gajesh and yeah we're gonna be in touch guys thanks a lot for watching smash like follow yes. gajesh and goodbye guys goodbye 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 yeah.